Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, the IPCC. One of the most profound statements in this report is that the United States is expected to experience as much sea level rise in 30 years as we saw over the span of the entire last century. The report predicts sea levels along the US coast will rise 10 to 12 inches on average by the year 2050, with amounts varying regionally primarily due to land shifts. Current and future emissions matter, but this will happen no matter what we do about emissions. If emissions continue at their current pace, it's likely that we will see at least two feet of sea level rise by the end of this century along the US coastline. Again, higher or lower in some regions due to land shifts. And that estimate is on the conservative side. Failing to curb future emissions could cause even greater impacts to Americans. This report is a wake up call for the United States, but it's a wake up call that comes with a silver lining. It provides us with information needed to act now to best position ourselves for the future. It's gonna take all of us, government, businesses, academia, community, citizens to make a difference in the future. As NOAA works to build a climate ready nation, this data can inform coastal communities and businesses about current and future vulnerabilities in the face of climate change. This information can help those communities make smart decisions to keep people and property safe over the long run. I'll now turn it over to our next speaker, my colleague, NASA Administrator Bill Nelson, who will share how NASA contributes to providing the Earth observations needed to better understand our climate. Administrator Nelson. Administrator 